Now to a developing story and another tragic loss for a family that's meant so much to San Diego. The older brother of Chargers legend Junior Seau died in a car crash in the East County. Savai Seau lived in El Cajon and was a PE teacher at Warren Walker Private School. Fox 5's Jamie Chambers has more on his impact on the community. The loss of Savai Seau is now just being felt across the San Diego community. Our prayers and our thoughts are with, you know, his mom and his dad, his brothers and sisters, uh, the whole family. The older brother of the late NFL star Junior Seau was killed in a head-on collision when his Audi A6 collided with a dump truck in Lakeside. The Seaus have been such a vital part to this center. And, uh, you know, that, not, that news was, that was difficult for us to hear, difficult for the community to hear. C.J. Palmer from the city of Oceanside runs the Seau Community Center and says the example of athletic excellence displayed by Seau's family has acted as inspiration to generations of young athletes. You know, that family has been through a lot, and um, so we're thinking about the family, and, uh, you know, hopes and prayers go out to them. 56-year-old Savai Seau was a tremendous athlete in his own right and taught PE at the Warren Walker School, a private institution, with his students calling him Kochi. The principal of Warren Walker released this statement. The hearts of the entire Warren Walker School community are heavy as we have lost a great human being, teacher, and a friend today. And in Oceanside, city officials echoed the feelings of loss. The Seau name in the community of Oceanside is, is forever going to be there. And it was a blessing to coach him, to know him. He was a better man than he was a football player. Uh, tremendously talented artist. He had just so many facets to his character. Coach Barrett said it was a personal honor that Savai went into coaching himself, being able to teach all those young athletes the lessons for generations to come. From Oceanside, Jamie Chambers, Fox 5 News.